he caddied for me for three years. I've known him for 30 years. Um, wherever we went in the world, he had a pal somewhere. And, you know, most people say that, but he actually did. And I think that's the one thing you can say about him. Everyone seemed to love him. His, his personality was great. Sense of humour, as dry as a bone. Um, just a great bloke. When we used to play the LPGA uh, quite a while ago, um, we always used to have this saying, I can't know if any of the, uh, the guys remember, but it was every now and again you'd meet someone and you'd, you, we'd have this saying, oh, I met someone, and someone else would say, yeah, do you know what? If they're not the nicest person in the world, they're definitely in the final. And to be honest, Gerald was one of those people and that was said quite a lot. You know, if he, if he wasn't the nicest bloke in the world, he's definitely in the final. He caddied for, ooh, I want to say, close on 20 plus years. Um, like I said, only three years for me because obviously he was ill just after we really got going three years into it. And But yeah, positive, um, knew what he was doing, kept up, shut up, great caddy. Whether it be breast cancer with women or prostate cancer with men, you have to get yourself checked. And it's not a nice thing to want to do because obviously you don't want to find out bad news. But the bottom line is the earlier you get checked for anything, then the much more chance you have of survival. And um, to be fair to Gerald, you know, this was, I mean, it wasn't a case of, it was literally out of the blue. Um, and he, did, he was getting checked about something and was given some just absolutely devastating news. Prostate cancer was the original diagnosis and, and he beat that. And that's, um, that was the amazing thing. So, you know, obviously it cost a lot of money for him to get his treatments. So we now have to try and uh, generate more money. So less people getting, you know, the people that do get it, get treated very quickly because he had to go to America to have it done and it would be lovely to think that you know over the years we could raise some money in Gerald's name and uh, stop if you just stop one person having this horrible ending then it would be brilliant.